Hello and welcome. You may be wondering, what does the hero's journey have to do with leadership? Well, the hero's journey was first recognized as a pattern in mythology by Joseph Campbell, who noticed that heroes and stories typically go through the same stages in their journey towards transformation and success. From Harry Potter to Star Wars, from the Lion King to the Lord of the Rings, we all know how the story goes. An innocent someone, our hero, is jolted from their everyday life by an unexpected event. They must decide to embark on an adventure, facing challenges, needing to grow, finding mentors and allies to join their quest. Ultimately, they find success and transformation as they complete one journey, only to discover the next. So what does the hero's journey have in common with leadership agility? Well, just about everything. We've architected this course to follow the patterns of the hero's journey. Our story begins with status quo, business as usual, the ordinary mundane reality of work today. Of course, what really is status quo today? The challenges of business today can't be predicted, ignored, or controlled. The stakes are clear. The only question, will you accept the call to lead? Leadership is a decision. The journey is risky and sure to have plenty of challenges. Answering the call to lead is a choice. What will you choose? The first step on the road to leadership agility begins with you. Assumptions, mental models, and perspectives need to be reframed as you embark on a path of continuous learning and growth. Stepping into the world of leadership agility and transformation can be disorienting. What personal North Stars will you use to navigate? When we step into the world of leadership agility, we notice a definite shift. The new realities and rules are unfamiliar. We need to connect with our team to help us navigate the challenges of this new world. And then there's a crisis of leadership, obstacles, resistance, setbacks. You wonder, who am I to lead this thing? We've all been there. The question, though, is who are you not to lead? Continuing to lead brings in an expansion of the leadership journey from self to team and now beyond. The challenge becomes one of seeing the whole of the work, the whole of the system, serving both your in immediate team and the needs of the greater organization. And change is hard. Leading change is harder. As we lead into this new world, we need to fundamentally change how we change. As we expand our perspective that change is a journey, not a destination, we begin to lead change rather than just manage it. In changing our mindset and culture, continuous change becomes our way of working. And throughout this leadership journey of growth and change, we discover a path forward for ourselves, our teams, and our organization. And oh, the stories we will have to tell. And now this cycle and our course is almost complete. You take stock of the treasures and learnings on this journey and begin to imagine what new adventures wait next. We look forward to having you join us soon as we explore the journey of Agile Leadership. Thank you so much.